Hey guys, if you want the chance to make roleplay videos like these, then be sure to check out all of my equipment, it is linked down in the description. Be sure to purchase the We Could Be Twins. And of course, don't forget to buy my merch, the link is also down in the description. Happy shopping peaches! Without further ado, let's get into the video. I better go take the kids to school, they've been waiting a while in the car, you probably should, it's getting kind of late, did you want a coffee to go? Yes please Lex, okay just wait here and I'll go get you one. It's just a coffee so it won't take too long, exactly, I will go do it right now. Arthur, I've made your coffee. I hope the kids don't moan at me for taking ages, well I can't promise you on that one. Well quickly you better hurry, they've been waiting for ages. Okay, see ya! Well, that has been quite an eventful morning. I'm glad that I didn't get the kids ready today. I left it all up to Arthur, so let's hope he hasn't done anything crazy like forget one of the kids. Trust me, it's happened before. But I'm just making myself some cereal because I don't want a huge breakfast. I woke up quite late, so I'm gonna go with some cereal. Okay, kids, let's go. Wait a minute, where's Avery? I cannot wait to get tucked into my cereal. Arthur, what are you doing back here? Lexi, do you know where Avery is? Avery, what do you mean? Is she not in the car? She's always first, but she's not there, no. That is so weird. Do you think maybe she took her bike or something? But it's quite cold. Well, that is really unlike her. So you can stay down here. I will see if she's upstairs. Don't be long, Lex. The kids will be late. I'll try my best. Hopefully she's upstairs. Avery, are you in your room? Uh, Avery, what are you doing? This is so unlike you, you need to get up. Um, nothing. <coughs> I don't feel well. Don't feel well? But you never miss school, Avery. I mean, to be fair, I did just kind of prove a point. You don't really ever miss school. So if you're feeling that unwell, I'm sure one day won't hurt. My tummy hurts and I've got a headache. Okay, that is not good. Quickly, let's go down and get you some medicine. Arthur, you better get going now. It looks like Avery is sick. Avery, why are you skiving? Oh, sorry, Avery. <coughs> okay, we really need to sort out this coffin. Here, take a seat. Feel better soon. Bye, Arthur. See you when you're back. Avery, you have to tell me next time when you're feeling unwell because I don't know. I was just waiting upstairs for ages thinking you were trying to get off school. Okay, now let's get you some medicine. I think we still have a little bit left, luckily. I'm really sorry for not telling you, Mum. It's okay, don't worry about it now, as long as you're feeling better after this medicine. I'm gonna go upstairs and play on my iPads. Avery, don't be silly. If you're feeling unwell, you can't be going playing Roblox on your iPad. You need to be resting all day. Oh yeah, of course. Okay, well, let's make sure you go get some extra rest. You can go up to your room and have a nice long sleep, right? Right. Okay, we'll get some rest, Avery. I'll be up soon. Time to play Roblox. Well, I decided that I was just going to stay indoors today and watch some TV. I'm currently watching the news. And I haven't heard anything from Avery. She seems pretty quiet, so maybe she's sleeping. I'm not sure. But I hope she's feeling better. Lexi, I'm home. Oh, hey, Arthur. You was quite quick today. What is that in your hand? I got Avery some soup. I also picked up a hot water bottle. And medicine. That is very kind of you, Arthur. But you do know that's chilly, right? I don't think that's the best thing to give her when she's feeling ill. But nice gesture, though. No, no, it's soup. Arthur, I've been cooking for years. That is chilly. I checked the package. Try a bit. Ouch, that's really hot. Told you it was chilly. Well, I guess I'll just eat that for lunch later. But um, that was actually quite a good idea. Maybe you could go around the shop in a while and get her some soup. Fine, you was right. Yeah, I'll go to the corner shop. Okay, perfect. 
Well, I'll see you when you're back then. And I'll get her a bit of chocolate. Bye! Hi, do you have soup? Um, why that look? Well, I'm just going to grab my dirty dish, put it in the dishwasher, and then I'm going to go check up on Avery because she's been really quiet, kind of too quiet. So I'm hoping that she is actually having a rest because that is what she is off for. Okay, you know what? I'm going to slightly open the door and hopefully she doesn't hear me and I can see what she's really up to. Oh, what is she doing? Roblox? I told her no Roblox. This game is so fun. That was so close. She nearly heard me. Finally, I'm back. Oh, hey Lex. You're not going to believe it. I got Avery this bean soup. Well, she is not going to need it because I just caught her playing Roblox. I mean, I hate to say it because this is something I would expect more from, like, Lewis. No, not my little Avery. That's what I thought. Avery doesn't lie. I know it is so unlike her. I can't believe this, but Arthur, I'm telling you, this is all fake. She was so hyperactive last night. And now suddenly she's ill? No, no, she's ill. I'll show you. I think I can hear footsteps. I can't believe you don't believe our own little daughter. I knew it, asleep. Aw, bless her. Are you kidding me? Ugh, I am so done with this. I told you, Lex. Arthur, I know what I saw. She was playing Roblox. I hope she likes her soup. Seriously, of all soups, you get bean soup. No one likes bean soup. And we ate bean soup. And don't you remember our first dates? Okay, whatever, not the point. I am still determined to prove to you that she is faking it. And I know exactly how. And how's that then? Just you wait and see. All I need for you to do is go make a cup of tea downstairs. Avery is so honest, she wouldn't lie. Uh, okay. Just go make the tea. Avery, time to wake up if you are actually sleeping. Wake up, Avery. Oh, mum. Come on, wake up. Did I fall asleep? apparently so you look so so ill avery looks like you're not going to be able to play roblox for months with how you look months is that going to be a problem uh no okay well avery i need you to come downstairs dad has made you a nice cup of tea and we need to check your temperature because you look super ill i don't know if i can i might throw up on the stairs what do you not have a temperature i do Okay, well, if you feel like you're going to be sick, then I'll just carry you. You see, you can never not check your temperature when you're ill. Tea's ready. Um, what even is this? Ignore that. Your dad went and bought chilli. I told you she would find that disgusting. Anyway, well, here's a nice warm tea, Avery. Hopefully that makes you feel better. Avery, do you need a hot water bottle or soup? Some candy will do. Candy? I don't think you should be having any candy or sweets when you're feeling ill. She needs to eat something. Okay, well, nothing unhealthy. A candy apple, Arthur. A candy apple. A caramel apple's fruit. Ugh, just give it to her then. The doctor says you need sugar in your body. Yeah, healthy sugars. Well, enjoy your caramel apple. Eat up, sweetie. And once you've had your caramel apple, here, take this thermometer and you can show us the results when you're ready, okay? Um, okay. Here's a sick bowl. Come on, Arthur. Arthur, follow me. Well, what if she is sick? Shh, you're very bossy today. Well, I don't like when they're lying to us. This is ridiculous. Shh, what am I going to do? I don't even have a temperature. I needed to be more prepared. What on earth is she doing? Shh, I told you, just wait. Gosh, sorry. I know, I'll put the thermometer in my tea. Then it'll come up that I'm boiling. Ha, perfect. Bum, look at my temperature. Can't believe I was wrong. <gasps> Avery Peach. Super high, Dad, look. Lexi, it smells of your herbal tea. Doesn't it just? 
care to explain, Avery? Yeah, because I just drank it. Yum. Arthur? Well, actually, I don't even know why I'm calling you out on it because it's not like your saliva is on it anyways. There is just tea on that. We saw you dip it in the stick. That's why I was so adamant about Arthur getting you a tea because I knew I would catch you out. Dad, you have to believe me. Dad saw it too. You literally saw me sleeping and I saw you playing Roblox. This is how this whole thing started. I, um, Roblox? Yep, I saw you. What even is Roblox? Don't play that trick on me, Avery. All you asked for for your birthday was Robux. Well, all I can say to you is that you are going to be grounded. If you tell us you're lying, we won't be mad. Grounded? Me? That's exactly what we thought. Who on earth thought that Avery would be grounded? Avery, come upstairs. Here you go. Miss Karen is waiting for you on a live lesson. Oh no, not this jail room. <laughs> Miss Karen. She's waiting for you right now. Hi, Miss Karen. Arthur, we've already grounded her. Don't embarrass her even more. Dad, the class is watching. Well, she shouldn't have faked it. <laughs> um, Avery does love cereal, Arthur. That is true. Don't forget to purchase my new real life merch. It's a link down in the description. And I really hope you guys enjoy. Don't forget to like, subscribe and hit that notification bell so you get notified every time I upload a video. And be sure to comment your video suggestions down below. I'd love to create them. Love you all so, so much. And I see you peaches next time. Bye.